Papa, we have to talk. Oh, I know what you're going to say, but I can't get the stage done and fit all that practicing in by jamboree night. But I can't practice the dance routine all by myself. And I can't do the stage decorations by myself. Hmm. What? No way! I can't dance! You just have to do a little bit so Mama can practice. It's the only way that I'll be ready for the dance demonstration. Okay, but only if no one sees me. Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much for offering to help me practice, brother. Now, I know you don't like to dance, but you do like sports, right? Sure. Well, I have an idea. We're going to try... Imagining. Imagining? What's that? Well, when Papa was a cub and had to do something that seemed hard, he would imagine that he was doing something else. Something fun. Now, do what I do. Imagine that you're a hockey goalie in the net. Good. Now... Wait for it. Wait for it. There's the shot. Pow! Catch the puck. Let's call that the goalie hustle. Cool! Now let's imagine another sports move. Watch me. The double bunt. Hey, I bunt better than anyone on my baseball team. Let me try. You're as good at imagining as you are at sports, brother. Okay, guess what I'm doing now? That's easy. You're imagining you're swimming. And now you're... Diving! I can swim and dive. Just watch me, Mama. The goalie hustle! Wait for it, wait for it, pow! <laughs> <laughs> this imagining is fun. So you like dancing then? Dancing? Those are sports moves, Mama. I'm not dancing. Yes, you are. I guess I am. This imagining really works. When you look at something in a different way, it does make it easier. Are you ready to try it again? You bet. One, two, three, four. Oh, I just can't do it. Can't do what, sis? I have to be able to kick ten times really high for my jamboree dance tomorrow. But it's just too hard.